here in Accra over the weekend, the second edition of the CEO's Table Tennis Championship was staged. After staging the first edition of the CEO's Table Tennis Championship, the cause for another competition was achieved over the weekend in Accra with the second edition. Over 50 participants settled down at the Tam Palace Hotel for the competition, which was put together by the Safety Communication Consult in partnership with a number of firms with the hope of promoting the game of table tennis through corporate Ghana. The competition attracted personalities from various backgrounds, including academia, politics, banking, engineering, among others. Defending champion Dr. Kweku Jampo braced himself for the challenge against a more fancy younger opponent and experienced hands like former Minister of State Ekos Pirogaba, lawyer Christopher King, among others. Every player of the tournament had the opportunity to play three plenary rounds of games. After a dramatic and trailing quarters, Dr. Kweku Jampo stood by for the semis as Chris King dispatched the former communication minister Kospirogaba before he had a bye for the final match. Determined to defend his title, Dr. Jampo played some fine tennis in the final and easily won the first set against lawyer Chris. Jampo won the second edition of the CEO Table Tennis Championship with two straight sets win over the Accra based Liga practitioner who finished ahead of Phil Darzi, Dr. Kospirogaba and Harry Baxin. The first five winners of the competition were all recognized at the closing ceremony with medals, a trophy for the winner, and product from the sponsors. We spoke to some of the participants. It's been absolutely fantastic. You know, I would not trade this for anything. Um, we've had fun, we've enjoyed ourselves, we've moved, we've, you know, exercised, we've exchanged numbers, we've networked, and uh, yes, it's, it's, it's the best ambience one could ever wish for uh, on a weekend like this. Hosting it in a corporate environment, in a hotel, has given a lot of people the opportunity to join as well and to see and observe and we hope that it will kindle interest in the sport especially among the younger generation because it's a sport which the sooner you begin playing it the better you can become over a, a long time so you can you can see that there are some of us who are in our 60s others are in their 50s and 40s which means that we have had exposure to the game over quite a long time oh wonderful wonderful i uh... I thought it would be a little bit much more difficult, and in fact, it was. Uh, the last two matches were very taxing, but uh, I was well prepared, so I came through. This is our first, uh, first time participating in this event. When my team told me about it, um, you know, I felt that it was definitely something that uh, it sounded interesting. Um, it sort of piqued my curiosity, and I wanted to find out what it was all about. To be honest with you, it has surpassed my expectations, right? Um, I always, I've met a number of uh, colleague CEOs here, and the nature of our job is such that it's an extremely stressful environment, and so sometimes if you're not lucky, you do not take time off to exercise at all. And, you know, table tennis is something that is, is quite enjoyable. It, may, it looks quite simple, but, you know, it's been a very good workout for me. Well, we say congratulations to the organizers of the CEO Table Tennis Championship. But for now, Commissioner, before we come back, we'll be talking about hockey in Africa.